what is going on everyone welcome back to our timpani bagong video and i'm sorry if i'm late with this magic of kuma reaction i just have been busy lately i have been going to going school recently because we were having clean clean up we will we will have face to face in the future class class face to face so sorry if i'm not explaining that clearly i'm just tired so yeah by the way i will schedule all my uploads like the magic of kuma will be um i think Wednesday so make sure you you guys check your schedules because I will be uploading magic of coma reactions every Wednesday from now on so and also fame high is I will be uploading it Saturday so fame high Saturday so that is it and that's my schedule for the uploads and magic of kuma episode 10 just came out three days ago so i'm late yeah i'm sorry guys <coughs> so without further ado let's get right into the action let's go okay <coughs> and also by the way i'm sick so yeah but i'm recording this just for you guys even if i am sick so. all right let's get right into the video <clears throat> episode 10 magic of kuma and the title of this is my first kiss okay let's go Ava and Jordan. Oh, 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 Jordan! Do you remember? <laughs> remember what? <laughs> when we were just little kids. We used to dance together under these lanterns every night. Oh, <laughs> how could I ever forget? Well, every night except until everyone started chasing us. That's true. <laughs> wow, that was so long ago. It must have been ages since the last time you danced here. Uh, um, yeah, yes. I mean, it's it's just been so long. I really do miss Remember, it. Remember, <laughs> he danced with As do I, Ella here. We have to get you home. Come on. Uh, Ava? Yeah? Actually, it's it's nothing. Oh. Do you okay. think Ava is his first kiss? Ava, what's the problem? I I just can't believe we're here. It's been so so long since you walked with me here. Mm. What? In the village? Where else would we be? The moon? <laughs> no, silly. I mean, here, here. Like, here in time. I just, I just never thought we would actually get older. We're almost adults. Well, I certainly Same. don't feel older. What difference adult. doesn't make anyways? You might I'll not. I'll be 18 but... next year. I know I do. Really? But why? Nothing has changed. Really? Nothing has changed? Life has become so much harder. We have all of these adult problems now. Oh, yeah. Right. Don't remind me, please. <sighs> hey! Wait up! Follow 
follow me. Hey, Va, your house is this way. <laughs> oh, I'm coming. Look, Jordan. It's our favorite conquered land. <laughs> Do you remember when we used to play pirates? Do I remember? Please, I still remember the silly name. We get that pile of rocks. <laughs> <laughs> silly? Chief Rye is stinky. It's a very mature name for an island. <laughs> So mature. <laughs> oh, we were so naughty. <laughs> so many we memories. We got pulled off so many times for jumping across Good that old island. memories. But we had to. We were pirates. We had to conquer new lands. We were too naughty. You got off easy. Remember, my dad is the chief. Do you reckon we could still make that jump? Hey, Va, I don't know what you're planning right now, but something tells me it is not safe. <laughs> Come on, it's getting late. We need to get you back home. Or oh, Auntie Bev will be worried. She's going to jump. <sighs> you're such a party pooper. Come on, it'll be fun. <laughs> hey, Va, you can't be serious. Ugh, wait for me. Ava, this Whee. is a bad idea. <laughs> what? Are you scared or something? <laughs> Excuse me, I am not scared. <laughs> oh. See, we still got it. <laughs> if we get caught, I am so blaming you. Luckily, we aren't going to get caught. Army hearties! It's good to be back here with me swashbuckling second in command, <laughs> Jardy Small Brain. <laughs> second in command? I distinctly remember being our captain. And my name was Jordy Big Brains. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> nah, your memory's broken. Do you still think that barrel of rice we buried under the ground is still here? I don't know, and I don't want to find out. I certainly don't want to smell it. Boring. <laughs> oh, Jordan. I wish we were still kids. Do you remember stealing beans from the market or hiding in the trees throwing dumplings on people's heads or all the times we hid under your dad's fancy chair? Oh, and don't forget the time we... What are you doing? Ooh. What I should have done a long time ago. Oh. Oh, shit. Sheesh. Okay. Good for them. Yeah. Let's go. Tis and what took you all so long? Uh, um, a long story. <laughs> she had a big night with a certain somebody. If you know what I mean. A big night with Annie Bev. <laughs> Anyways, where's Jordan? Really Probably As making out with his small hot brain. wife. Ow! What was that for? It's the truth. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> serves him right. <laughs> wow. I didn't think it was possible for girls to be strong. <laughs> oh! <laughs> shut him up. <laughs> so, Grandmother Maya, why'd you ask us to meet here? Today. Ava is going to use the magic of Kuma to unpoison, heal, and bring back to life the entire rice crop. The entire thing? I know, I know, it does sound a little crazy. But according to my research, once Ava gets the magic flowing, everything should be fine. I hope However, so. if something does go wrong, I thought having some extra hands to help out would be a smart idea. Wait, so does that mean I have to wake up Tiz? I think it'd be better to just leave him like He's this. He's knocked out. <laughs> he probably would have caused more trouble awake anyways. <laughs> <laughs> all right. We better get started. Ava, it's all up to you now. I hope it's going to work though. Come on, Eva. You can do this. 
The whole village is counting on you. I believe in you. Oh. Wow. It's more powerful than I thought. Jeez. It's working! It's working! Ava, you're doing it! You just saved the village! Where is she? <gasps> Where is she? What's taking Jordan so long? We always have courting at the same time. If he's off with Ava again, uh, that must be him. Nope. Ella, it's an emergency. It's Jordan. You need to come with me now, quick. What happened? There's no time to explain. It's we a have prank. To go now. It's a trap. It's a prank. Is everyone? There's no one here. What's going yep, on? It's a prank. Turn around, princess. How nice to finally see you again. Oh, Ella. you're in trouble. Ugh. Can I get you something to drink? Some tea, perhaps. I'm good, thanks. How about something to eat? A bit of revenge with a side of death, maybe. What do you want? Oh, honey. It's not about what I want. It's about what your father wants. And right now, he wants you to come back home. Immediately. And then, explain everything you know to him. And what if I refuse? <laughs> I'll have Jordan poisoned. Yep. Please, you're useless without me. Blackmail. There's no way you even be able to get to Jordan, let alone poison him. You have no way past his guards. Only I have that position. Perhaps. But as long as I'm around, you won't be getting anywhere near him. <laughs> Always so quick-witted. You are too confident in your own abilities. <laughs> so that's a no to coming back then. That's correct. Now let oh. me go, or someone other than Jordan will die tonight. Sheesh. I will be leaving now. Where did you get that sword? Let her go. Ben, get the poison. You know what to do. This will be fun. Uh oh. <laughs> I have a bad feeling about this. My lovely There's people Ava. of Hikari, it brings me great joy to announce to you all today that this incredible young girl, Ava, has brought our entire rice crop back to life. What was once dead is now living. We shall have plenty of food for the winter. Oh, we've been saved. She is our hero. Now that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Looks like me and the boys can still me have and the boys. Friday boys night. She's a blessing me and the sent homies. from the gods of Kuma. We should give her a reward. Yes, Ava should be rewarded. What? Then how come I don't get a reward? Without her, we would have never survived the winter. I hear you all loud and clear. This unbelievable act has saved our entire village from starvation. Ava should be rewarded as a hero to show our but true appreciation won. and gratitude. According to the traditions of our elders, Ava will be granted one wish for whatever she wants. Ooh. My servants and court will see to it that this wish is what fulfilled if she wants immediately. Jordan. Anything at what all? What are you gonna do? Wish for the finest silk dresses in Hikari. Or a palace room. Why would she do that? Wish for golden riches. You can't eat gold. 
Ask for a lifetime supply of brain dumplings! <laughs> I understand this is a very difficult decision to make. So I shall grant you till the end of this week to think long and hard about what you truly wish for. Thank you for your generous offer, but I will not be needing the week. I know exactly what I want. You do? Jordan. I would like to wish for Jordan's hand in marriage. Oh! Jordan, will you marry me? Oh, shit! Ava, you know I can't do that. You Bro, can't you said... do that? What are you on about? You're the chief. She saved everyone here. You have to you allow it. You said anything. Yeah, what has Ella ever done for us? Nothing! Jackal! Oh. Fact, she can go back to Ada where she belongs! Burn! Silence! It's tradition. It's our law. If that's what she wants, you have to grant it to her. And as Jordan, the son of Chief Rye, I accept her offer. Sheesh! Oh. Damn. Quiet, please. Silence. <laughs> Quiet. Cool. Jordan, Ella, come with me. We're leaving now. What? What is going on, dude? You said anything, bro. You need to get your act together. Start acting like a man. Start acting like the son of the chief. Start acting like Hikari's future chief. And stop acting like a weak, lost little boy. But Ella is perfect for you. She loves you. She will keep the peace with Ido. She will be a fantastic leader for the village. No. And you need to open your eyes and see that. That's not. But since you won't listen to your father, even though he knows what's best for you, I know someone who can do a lot more damage. Ella, let him have it. Oh, thank goodness he's gone. Right, Ella? Shut up! Whoa! Don't tell me! I can't believe you! Ella! You disgust me! I trusted you! What about all we talked about? What about all you said? What about our dance? Did that all mean nothing to you? No, but... Do you not get it? Are you that selfish and consumed by your own self-interest and wishes? I'm not some object that you could just... Use it and throw away when you feel like it. I'm a person too. I didn't make this choice either. Once upon a time, I also loved someone else, but I had to let them go because it was the right thing to do. It's all about you, isn't it? You have no idea how much I've sacrificed to try and make this work. You're right. I don't know. I can't even begin to know, but I do know that this is certainly not the right thing to do. How can you say that? Do you remember when I told you that relationships right are now. the most important things in life? Well, it's even more important that those relationships are genuine. I made a mistake, and I'm sorry for that. I am. But what we have, it isn't love. It was forced. So what? Everything you said and did? How you said you wouldn't leave me? How you said you loved me? None of that was real? I didn't know what I was saying. I was lost and confused. Bro. I'm still a kid, you know? I didn't know what the right thing to do was. But I do now. No. I get it. You're a liar. Awkward. So, <laughs> uh, nice weather we had today. <laughs> or not, I guess. Does anyone want to say anything at all? I can't believe you missed Chad's meeting this morning, Grandma. Oh, yeah, that. Well, I'm sure it wasn't that interesting anyways. 
So maybe we can talk about something else instead. <laughs> oh no, you are so wrong. Normally, Dad's meetings are so boring that I want to stick chopsticks in my eyes. <laughs> but this time, I didn't even yawn once. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice, Esther. <laughs> what about the rest of your day? Is there anything else you'd like to talk about? Anything at all? Why would I want to talk about anything else? You should have seen it. Ava asked to marry Jordan in front of the whole village. Dad was so mad. It was so funny. He was like, you know I can't do that. Even though he obviously can. That'll be enough from you, Esther. She does have a point, though. You could let Ava marry Jordan. <sighs> no, I can't. Case closed. You do know not granting her wish would be against the law. Well, you know what? What? We can change that. Why? Because I'm the chief. You can't just change the law to suit yourself. That's unlawful. I am the law. Ugh, you still won't be able to stop Ava. Oh? Do you think I'm going to let a puny punk girl get in my way? Bro. That chance. There's nothing you can do to stop her. Really? You know what? I'm introducing a new law right now. Uh -oh. If Ava asks about marrying Jordan, or even so much as thinks about marrying what? Jordan from now on, I'll have her arrested for life. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you happy? That's going too far. <gasps> you can't do that. Oh, yes, I can. And I did. Th th that, that makes you no better than Chief Cairo. Silence! This is the end of that discussion. We will talk about something else. How about We've been talking We've back to your kind of soup before. Mother. What's in it, mother? I didn't make it. Well, that explains why it smells so good. Wait, if you didn't make the soup, who did? Oh, you know that lovely young girl, Belle. She came along to visit my house this morning and bless her kind uh -oh. soul. Oh no. She made all of this soup for me. Poison. She said it was a gift. What a sweet child. It's a freaking she just poison. Gave it to you? Yep. You didn't ask her for it? You didn't do anything for her? Nope. Nothing at all? Does she bring you gifts normally? Not usually. This is the first time, actually. Uh -oh. Do you know what's in it? Not a clue. She said it was her own secret recipe. Well, there's only one. Oh, uh, no. To find out. No. No. Don't drink it. You can't tell me what to do. No. What in the name of Kuma? What did you drink all my soup for? Ella just did it. <laughs> we need to get her medicine. Oh, quick. shoot. Whoa. God. Did not expect that. Oof, oof, oof. Wow. God damn. This story is going interesting and interesting. Oh my god. Whew. So guys, that is it for the episode reaction video. Remember, um... Magic of Coma reaction Wednesday, fame high, Saturday. So don't do not miss it out. So that is it guys. Subscribe, like, peace.